Fala pessoal, beleza? Fernando Rodrigo na área novamente, trazendo mais um capítulo. Dessa vez vamos verificar algumas informações aqui. Ah, tá com os olhos roxos ainda, na porrada que levou. Ah, ok. Vamos ver se tem ligação com a morte. Vamos sair aqui para ver o que acontece. Ah, fechado. Não, 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 não. He opened it during the war. That's odd. Desculpa. William P. Gordon. Caraca, velho. Tem figurinha pra todo lado nesse jogo. A gente Tem que ter sido leão, né? Falar nisso, tem um negócio legal que o cara é um, uma pantera, mas não bebe leite. Ok, Ronald B. Spoke Story. Hello. I know you're hiding something. What? I know about Joyda. You are super modern. I know how much Dunn meant to you. I'm very sorry for your loss. Um, I don't think I. Your handwriting on the envelope. Your date of birth on the safe. My goodness. I... I can't talk here. My shift is over in ten Ooh. minutes. Can you wait a while? Yeah, of course I do. Can I get a refill over here, Mary? Coming right up. Ok. 
aí ela vai sair em 10 minutos e vamos conversar. O John foi direto no assunto. Ele disse era que o Sabe disse algo e que, que a combinação do cofre é uma data de aniversário dela. Por isso que ela está sofrendo mais do que ela transparece. found in his golden years. We've been seeing each other for almost two years. It all started with, well, weekdays I start cleaning the gym at dawn, before my shift at the diner. Joey always came in early, just a little after I got there. He used to say it was the best time for the worst task of the day. Oh, I know exactly what he meant. Worked out first thing, huh? Oh, no. He used to say that showing his boxers how to fight was exercise enough. Paperwork. He just hated it. But that was just him. Instead of putting off the things he couldn't stand, he did them as soon as possible. One morning, he saw me crying. I was having a rough day and... He tried to make you smile. He pointed at the coffee machine. You need a cup of joe and some fresh air. That was the first of many cups on the rooftop. Which is where Dunn seduced you. That word is a bit too much, Mr. Blackside. You might be too young to understand this, but real love has little to do with seduction. One day, we realized those rooftop coffees were the best part of our day. So we began to spend more time together. But you never told anyone. Or perhaps you told someone else? No one. Joey didn't want Sonia to hear about it from someone else before we were sure of the relationship. He was afraid that our relationship would only make matters worse. Until one day, on the rooftop, we realized just how serious our relationship was. And we decided to turn those moments into a lifetime. So, he asked you to marry him? Yes, of course. He gave me the wedding ring and we decided to tell the world. He said he needed to share that happiness with his little girl. Turns out, he wasn't that happy after all. What about you? How did you feel about telling Sonia? Maybe you already noticed. I, I have a slight cold. I really should be heading home. Too much coffee and fresh air? Why? Why would you say that? I lost my scarf a while back. Not sure where. And now, if you'll excuse me, that's my bus stop. A pleasure to speak with you, Mr. Blackstone. Right. Ok. Foi até ela e descobriu realmente que eles tinham um caso e que eles iam se casar. Ele deu o anel da esposa dele, da ex-esposa para ela. Eles iam anunciar o casamento para o mundo, se dizer assim, mas acabou não dando certo, ele morreu antes, ou se matou, sei lá. Vamos voltar lá até onde ela estava, tá, cafeteria, só para ver se... Foi lá no restaurante, né? Ah, não dá para ir, eu acho, porque ela não está lá, o jogo não permite. Que C 
certo esse carro aqui dá pra interagir não dá pra interagir Vamos conversar com o nosso amigo aqui. Vamos ver se ele está bem, se está com fome, com sede. Ah, e ele não está. Que legal. Eita, o que aconteceu aqui? Ah não, ele fica na outra esquina aqui, ó. Esquina, sei lá. Ele tá dormindo. Vamos ver se ele tem guardado alguma coisa. Tá dormindo nada, safado. Hey buddy! Wake up! Tá dormindo mesmo. Eu vou entrar aqui. E a gente precisa ligar pra alguém? Vamos ver. Uh, chef of Souls is in North. Vou ligar pra ele. Hey boys, how are you doing? You're gonna like what I have to tell you about the Dunn case. I know Dunn, to the clean lady, we get. Dunn and the gym's cleaning lady were about to get married. The combination on Dunn's safe was her birthday. He even gave her a ring. You know, your typical suicidal bliss. Okay, I'm still not convinced, but I might have something for you. Opa! Ele tem algo para nós. Vamos lá, então. Life is off and off key, like a bad song. The notes come together but feel flat, unable to create anything resembling music. There are ways to string them together to create harmony, ways that are not always entirely in our hands. You look tired, John. <laughs> I was born tired. I'm used to it. You're not the only one. Yep, I'm beat. I'm starving. Just got back from the annual police medical. Not only did I have to fast, but I also had to chug two enormous glasses of water. John, you all right? I've had better days, and I'll have them again. I hope. We both deserve to. The thing is, I'd love to help you out with this case, but I can't. You know I work for the state of New York. If I had any information, I couldn't share it with a private eye. Even if it was lying on top of this table. You said you were starving. Why don't you go to the counter and order something? Hmm? Yeah, sure. Good idea. Good idea. If you'll excuse me.
Ele deu uma jogada aí, galera. Quanta informação? Temos quatro. Então vamos lá. Um de cada vez. Ah. Ah, Joseph Richard Dunn, sexo masculino. Olhos marrons, 47 anos. Ok. Mandar minha saída da manhã, causa da morte, apexia, suicídio, suicídio. Ah. Foi contado quatro marcas de. Ah, no seu pescoço. Aparentemente é alguma. Deve ser pelas cordas, né? Mas. Interesting. Interessante. Ali, aliás, algo além das cordas, né? Em seu pescoço. Provas encontradas. Autópsia, sinal de evidência de. Ok. Now that I think of it, I better eat at home. It's healthier. Thanks. Truth is, John. Seem clear to me before, but now, please promise me you won't take the law into your own hands. I'd like to think we're not just vigilantes. I give you my word. Sure, you can trust me. I give you my word. All right. In any case, keep me posted, will you? Friend, you can count on it. Take care, John. As always, Smirnoff had given me new, potentially relevant information. Not to mention second thoughts. When an old dog like him gets that serious, one must be prepared to bite. Okay. Uh, okay. Vamos analisar a situação aqui. Okay. Uh, Mary was coach. Verdade, né? Ok, algo em seu pescoço. Ah, quase diferentes marcas em seu pescoço. Suicídio Não Ele está no conflito. O que isso tem a ver? Não. Ah, o óbvio, né? Hum.
É, aí tem que entender que pelo peso e altura dele, era difícil ele se suicidar como ele fez, né? Ele precisaria de ajuda para fazer isso, ou ser forçado e ser colocado lá por alguém. Okay. I'm much taller than Dunn, and I can barely reach the news. É, eu imaginei isso também no começo do game. There's no way Dunn hanged himself. Not on his own, at least. Não por conta própria, ao menos. Isso mesmo. I don't know why. Something just doesn't add up. Uh, vamos conversar com a senhorita lá em cima. Ver o que ela tem a dizer. Esse cara aqui é estranho. A mulher não tá aqui não, ah tá. Did you find anything interesting in those papers? No. Investigation work takes time, as I'm sure you know. Uh, Joe is drawn fight with by whale. Uh, Do you remember anything else about Joe Dunn and Bobby Yale's argument? No, not, uh, not really. No, only Joe yelling. If you do, I'll call off the fight and kick you out of the gym. Not all folks are as open-minded as Dunn. I happen to know who painted the lockers. Arthur Tucker. I knew it. I knew it was him, that bastard. I'm gonna whip the white out of him. What exactly was he saying? Uh, something like, uh, if you do that, I'll call up the fight and make sure you never set foot in this gym again. Vai mexer no armado do cara de novo, hein? A gente é corajoso, hein?
दादाजी भाई देखिए भाभी है Vamos começar com o cara lá, o um mendigo. Se a gente não tiver nada pra falar, a gente termina o capítulo por aqui. Vamos ver. Eu tô legal se ele dá essa corridinha. Pessoal, é, vou ficar com esse capítulo por aqui. Posso o capítulo a gente resolve mais mistérios. Se você está curtindo, deixa o like, comenta aí, se inscreva no canal. Você que não é inscrito, espero que todos tenham curtido. Um grande abraço, fiquem com Deus. Até mais, fui.